Hey guys, Kush here, and it's time for another reaction video. This time, we finally have the second trailer for F9. We have got some TV spots, but we finally have an official second trailer. About a year ago, we were supposed to get the movie last May, but because of the you-know-what, it had to get delayed about a year, waiting so long. But now, because Godzilla vs. Kong has been doing much better than expected, Movie studios are now more confident to put their films in theaters. So with how things are going, more people being vaccinated, F9, yeah, I, I'm pretty sure it's going to come out this year. I doubt there will be any changes, especially with how long people have been waiting for this movie. Delaying it again will make people upset. And also, movie theater, movie studios, just it, it'll be too much if they keep, kept delaying and delaying and delaying. That wouldn't be good for them. Some people feel films like Snake Eyes are even moving up closer a few months sooner. And if everyone's wondering, yes, I have seen the TV spots. I have seen spots, so I wasn't able to make reactions to them, unfortunately. And usually I don't do TV spots unless it's something super special. And for those of you who didn't read the description of my update video, yes, I'm sorry I didn't do reactions for Black Widow and Suicide Squad new trailers. I was busy and I was focusing a lot on my Sailor Moon video. But back on the topic, is there anything else I want, anything specific I want to say? Well, I did hear that they're supposed to be going to space in this movie. I don't know how that's going to fit in, but the Fast and the Furious films, they don't really make much sense, but that's why they're so much fun. They just defy all logic because power family. <laughs> oh, but that's why I like them. They can be a little cheesy, but that's why I love them. Good actors, good action, funny. Good stunts too. Plus, this one has John Cena, Vin Diesel versus John Cena. All right, that's gonna be awesome. And I remember last show they brought Han back. The reason why I didn't notice at first was because I didn't see the movies with Han yet, so I didn't exactly. Because uh, again, when, I, when that show first came out, I was still getting into Fast and the Furious. But now I've seen all the movies, including Hobbs and Shaw, so I know what's going on. I know that's Han. They'll need to explain how he's still alive, though. That's one thing fans are confused about, but I'm sure they're going to explain this movie. Probably because of the Powell family. <laughs> no, that, that, that was just a joke. they, they got to give us a good reason to why. But so, about what, what I wanted to say, I'm happy they're bringing most of the cast back. And Unfortunately, The Rock couldn't make it into this movie, but hopefully he'll be in the next one, which I believe the next one after this is supposed to be the last one. But it kind of makes sense. Actors are getting older, and it's been... Now, 20, uh, uh, 20, almost 20 years since the first movie. In just a couple months, the first movie will be having its 20th anniversary. <laughs> Crazy how time flies. And looking back at it, just so much has changed. But, now that I've said that, let's get on to the trailer. The world has a way of changing. And we change too. My man. Oh, Paul Walker. But we always come back together. We heard y'all needed a little love out here. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah. Y'all ever thought about the wild missions we've been on? We've taken out planes, trains, tanks. I'm no. not going to even think about the submarine. <laughs> <laughs> well, Tyrese Gibson, too. Who is he? Jacob is. Dom's brother. Been a long time, Dom. Little brother. You always say never turn your back on family, but you turned your back on me. Now your little family is in my world. Oh, yeah. Oh. But could you kill him? <laughs> <laughs> Get 
Debbie, you write something with your dog? <laughs> They're bringing, they're bringing Shaw, Shaw's mother back, too. Crank it all the way up. Yeah, I think that's Shaw's mom. Awesome. Ooh. Like a magnet bomb. is back. <laughs> that was sick. <laughs> I like how they like give us a little recap of the first trailer, but also with um, some new things too. New things like like new fight scenes, new shots, and more funny scenes. We also see a bit more about the, the story, like um, why Jacob is after Dom, and uh, we we don't know why, but we, there, there's a reason why he's after. We just we know, we know what the reason is, we just don't know the full story behind it yet. But they, they should explain it in the movie. Most seeing most of the cast is back. And that little video of Paul Walker. Oh. When I see you again, oh. Needed to get that out. But that was a great trailer. It's coming out in June. And with how things are going, yep, I think this is going to stay for June. I, I'm pretty sure it's, it's not going to get delayed. If it's delayed, it's probably by a few weeks or a month, but let's not jinx it. I doubt it, but let's not jinx it. I'm, I'm excited for this movie, and it might be the highest grossing film of this year with the, the list of films we've got out, got out now. And with how much money Godzilla vs. Kong is still making, by the time this movie comes out, things should be different, but let's see what happens. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed what you saw, please like, subscribe, and share for friends. If you have an idea for my show, tell me in the comments below or to the email up there, and I'll be sure to put them into consideration. Thank you again for watching, and I hope you all have a great day.